I'm Jeff McLaughlin. I'm the general manager for the Mansion Hotel, also the uh, area general manager for the Kessler Collection here in Savannah. My name is uh, Christopher Coyle, and I'm the general manager of the Bohemian Hotel, uh, Savannah Riverfront. The hotel was developed with the Historical Society here in Savannah, so that when you walk into the property, um, you, you feel like you're going back in time. The, the embodiment of the hotel is tied in with 1733 and the founding of Savannah. So the, the concept is that the, our guests are arriving on an English trade ship, which may have been docking here right on the Savannah River. Not only the newness, but the uniqueness and the detail of the property uh, is going to enhance not only our neighbors, our neighboring hotels, but the city as well. You know, we have 11 hotels and, and all of them are individual uh, in, as far as their design, but they all revolve around music and art. Uh, if you look at the, uh, no matter whether it's here or Asheville or Orlando, uh, every hotel has different types of uh, artwork. Richard Kessler is a renowned art collector uh, in the United States. We're the only company that has a uh, art curator that's part of the executive staff of, uh, of the corporation. I would rival the hotels with many of the different art museums that you can go into now in, in some of the bigger cities. When you come into Savannah, it's really what the South is all about. Just so comfortable to, to walk around the town and cover the entire entire city of Savannah on a walking tour. And there's so much history here. Uh, you know, you're walking by and seeing homes that are built in the 1750s, 1760s, and in the early 1800s. The uh, book and the movie of the Midnight of Garden and Good and Evil really put Savannah on the map. Uh, and then you have, of course, Paula Dean was, uh, was very instrumental with her cooking show. So you, you can come up here, you can have great food, we have a number of restaurants that are here. All of the restaurants and all the dining experiences that are here in Savannah uh, just create a very, very unique city and a welcoming city. Even some of the cemeteries, and of course if you talk to people, they'll say that Savannah is, the, uh, is one, of the, one of the cities with the most ghosts of any, uh, any city in the, in the United States. So you come in and uh, get an opportunity to go on a uh, ghost tour and see how that goes too.